Everybody, we have a great new collaboration that's going to be going on here uh, with books, the museum, all kinds of discovery will be happening. And I love this. I love this setup. Good morning to everyone who's here. Uh, we're talking about the Joyride Bookshop and the new Children's Museum. So let's start with you. What is going to be happening and changing at the museum? Yeah, so we are really, really excited to announce that Joyride Bookshop is going to be joining the museum, <laughs> uh, the new Children's Museum, which is located in downtown San Diego. Um, they are going to be our new store at the museum selling their incredible selection of books and then also working with other artists uh, to sell additional items which I know they will share much more yeah. soon but we're really 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 excited that's about. really cool I mean yeah. I would think that all goes really well together right the museum's all about discovering new things and learning and of course we know books provide the same mm -hmm. that's Definitely. great uh, let's talk about the joyride bookshop so ladies what is this tell me what you guys offer here well, um, so Katie and I started talking uh, together in 2019 mm -hmm. about opening a children's bookstore, and we settled on the idea of having it be mobile <laughs> and reaching lots of different kinds of communities. Can we step in and just take a look at what all you yeah. have? So mobile, This does someone drive this around? Yes. Oh, okay. oh yes. <laughs> we do. <laughs> you are one of the drivers. All over town. Gotcha. Yeah. And then what do you do normally? You'll pop into neighborhoods and have books available? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so we'll partner with uh, with organizations okay. in different communities for example we did mass creativity with the new children's museum okay. last summer we actually <laughs> met Ayati nice. last summer so we we pulled up at this huge celebration that they did where the museum was <laughs> open and free for the whole day we've done the mini minge with the minge international museum nice. we've worked with children at the monarch school yeah. um, so being able to actually get to different organizations schools mm -hmm. um, has been really fun and it looks like a wide variety for different ages different interests mm -hmm. uh, tell us some of the books how do you guys even yeah. choose what's in there yeah we're we are board books all okay. the way up through young adult um, and we. What do you mean by board books? Uh, board books meaning um, for the youngest readers. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, it's gotcha. more of a the, board instead, so of, instead of paper. So the kids that mm -hmm. are still drooling don't ruin the Correct. pages. Exactly. I have little ones. I completely Definitely. understand. Exactly. <laughs> Mine would eat the pages. I'm like, oh no, no, the board books are better. Yeah. Okay, so perfect. So that's when they're younger. But then obviously so many for a lot of older kids. A too. lot of, yeah, we, yeah. we really specialize in, um, in beautiful picture books um, and middle grade books books. We um, try to support independent publishers right. yeah. as much as possible and um, underrepresented authors and illustrators. Okay, so give them this great platform. I see a couple kids reading over here. I wanted to come talk to you two. Uh, it's so cool to see, first of all, kids reading. I love it. What's your name? Connor. Connor, what are you reading about? <laughs> it looks like really cool illustrations. Let's see the cover. It's called... Chicken what is it? Chicken in, the kitchen. Chicken in the kitchen. That's awesome. And the illustrations are beautiful, bright, colorful. What's your name? Kira. Kira. And what are you reading? Sports are fantastic fun. It looks like you two both love reading. What do you think about books? Um, they're fun. <laughs> they're fun. How old are you, Kira? Nine. Nine. And what about you, Connor? How old are you? Six. Six years old. And look at these. These are pretty good advanced books for you. So that's <laughs> awesome. Impressive stuff. And it's so great to see kids' interest in this. Um, I want to bring you all back in uh, because obviously when it comes to the museum, we know kids have a blast inside. They're learning. They're exploring. Uh, how important is it to have books obviously a part of what your mission is as well? Yeah, I think it's the museum is all about creativity, exploration, and creating a sense of belonging. And I think with the stories that you all curate and select, it's really sharing stories that um, that are of all of our communities. Um, and so I think it's the perfect addition to the museum because it's really representative of, of everybody in San Diego and, and on a wider scale as well. Right. So, which is very excited. Oh, I'm very happy <laughs> yeah. to hear that. And obviously, you know firsthand the importance of books. Yeah. If you could describe, uh, you know, why kids need to read mm. <laughs> and, be, and be kind of immersed in this. Sure. We, um, so I just want to say too, we, uh, Think that it's super important that not not only should the uh, you know every child have access to mm -hmm. um, 
different stories from all over the world, but also have the opportunity to see themselves mm -hmm. in a story. Yeah. So we actually apply a diversity audit to our stock at all times. Right. We're constantly going through and making sure. And then, you know, when families come in and ask very specific questions, we learn from them too. Oh my goodness, yeah. we need to go and source more books for more I stories. Yeah. Um, so it's always, it's like mm -hmm. this a constant adventure. It's coming from a family with multiple cultures in our background, I'm always um, in search of that so I appreciate that a lot uh, real quick we have like 20 seconds left when can people come see all of this come together Saturday May 13th okay. yeah <laughs> at the new Children's Museum at downtown San Diego yeah. yep. across from the convention center can't yep. miss it okay thank you all for being with us and we'll be right back after this break